punished for not following the school's orders after wearing a shirt that showed her shoulders and back. Tonight, Tanya Mendes shows us the suspension is causing all sorts of backlash at the school. We broke this story last week, and now it has gone viral. People writing to Hickory Ridge High from all over the world. The sheriff's office telling us they've received 5,000 phone calls and emails, some of them threatening, and the sheriff's office is investigating. I had it right here. A collarbone creates a backlash no one saw coming. An honor roll student suspended after a dress code violation. Full ride means so much, and that is on the line right now. Summer wore a top that showed her shoulders and back. When confronted by the principal, Summer covered up. The principal told Summer to go to the office anyway, and she refused. I stayed in my seat, just like a lot of role models that I have looked up to stayed in their seats. She was slapped with a 10-day suspension for insubordination and banned from walking at graduation. Well, the sheriff's office says 5,000 people have now written letters and called Hickory Ridge High's principal, blasting her decision. Where does this stop? The sheriff's office says they're investigating emails threatening to harm the principal. And after rumors of students planning to protest in support of Summer, the school now scaling back a senior award ceremony this week. The only seniors that will be participating in Senior Awards Day are those who are recipients of an award or a scholarship. Summer would have been honored at that ceremony. Not now. Instead, she sits at home, her future hanging in appeals. It's just sad because I worked so hard for four years to walk across that stage. The school system still not commenting on this case and they won't tell us whether Summer will be allowed to walk. The sheriff's office says they've never seen anything like this before. Reporting in Cabarrus County, I'm Tanya Mendez, NBC Charlotte. Turning out to the forecast, want to take a live look. This is the scene here in South Charlotte. You can see that down tree. Our Xavier Walton just reporting from that.